age that leaves Kirby at a huge disadvantage, though. Maybe Battlefield or... I think Battlefield and Epic, the stages with the really high ceilings, where yeah. his up, where his up throw or maybe some of the, his other kill options won't kill me quite as early. Does but Mewtwo being such a light character, he's still dying. Does Kirby struggle interacting with ledges? His what? Or, like when he's on a stage with ledges, do you think he struggles at all? Or? I know that uh, Mewtwo has a huge advantage actually on Battlefield, so. Um, I think I think Death Wars would probably like to take him to either. Uh, I know Death Wars well, right? yeah. Maybe Dreamland, yeah. uh, or even just Smash. Them. I think people also really like Dreamland, so yeah. it could be any stage really. I don't think either of them are going to. Yeah. But uh, Duck Hunt's probably the stage Maple wants to go to the most, and then after that, I'd say Dreamland, just because low ceiling and the platforms. Yeah. Very effective. It just depends on if Death Horse is willing to take him there. Yeah. There's also a uh, number of things that Kirby can actually crouch under, I think. Uh, I think he can actually crouch under dash attack if Death Horse doesn't do it at the right time. He could probably crouch fair too, and I know Death Horse really likes fair. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, you see Death Horse getting a lot of really strong fair strings at both. You can crouch up smash. Oh, yeah? Yeah. That's definitely going to be useful. Uh, maybe forward smash as well. But I don't think Death Horse would struggle too much with that because down tilt, down smash, like mm. near would yeah. catch him. But as long I think uh, Death Horse will be able to get kills fairly early, but I think getting the percent might be hard because on Kirby, you might only be able to get one or two fairs uh, maximum. Yep. What? So they start smash They start smash for Death Horse opening up with a down tilt. Usually, uh, Death Horse starts off with a uncharged shadow ball, yeah. so it's nice to see the kind of mix up. But, oh, down tilt, fair, and he goes for the shadow ball, he's really close. He's getting hit by him. He's the air dodge, but he's too late on the punish. Oh. What is too early for the new spike? Oh, a down smash. Oh. And he eats him, takes his <laughs> shadow ball. It'd be interesting to see what Maple can do with the Mewtwo shot. But uh, with him having a fork, he can do something. Good landing on the platform. Really covers that. That course is. Oh, he oh, gets a fair wow, kill at the top. 80%. Oh, wow. Very early. Early Might have been a mix of bad DI, but I don't think. It's really. You just heard probably would have killed that. I think so too, especially that close to the edge. I don't know, light, lightweight with Kirby. It's gonna kill him. Let's see what it goes for. Any attempts to grab with Meeple Good Watches? Trying to get those down tilt things. Or even just the near. Meeple knowing he has to approach now, which is hard for him. It's been, oh, I. Good, really good smash. Good smash. The first one he's done in the whole set. Covers the bear landing. Death Horse is now looking for a lot of very aggressive options, but Nair is very hard to find. Yeah, With Kirby's options, it's not that worse worst idea. Oh my gosh, that was scary. Um, looking for the Nair to fair action. Oh, oh my gosh, nice! Gets the dare and spike. Death Horse just smiles all over. Yeah, you see him going for the dare spike a lot when you go. Maple didn't play bad at all though, it was just unfortunate I guess, but... You know, first off, he was playing very well, so let's see if he can bring it back. I feel like Maple's defense is doing a good job, but he just needs to work on making sure he gets hit by a little less bears, maybe uh, well, plays more careful a, around the air from him, too. He's also in an uncomfortable position because he knows he has to approach, yeah. which is difficult for him as a player, I know, but well, like, it's not bad. We'll just have to see how he can create stage control with a character like Furby against in a matchup like this. But it is very uh, nice to see him taking it to Duck Hunt. Oh, a nice cool combo. But and oh, we're, I just realized we're on Duck Hunt. Yeah, so the tree might play a big advantage, but at this rate, it is not looking like it. Death Hunt's getting a lot of bears. Tell him to bring a platter of his food. It's really hard to do. Approach right now. That person is zoning on his different games. And it is fair, down tilt, and even dash attack if he misspaces an area. And Shadow Ball was always putting on that pressure to That was a good mix up, um, air dodging onto the stage again. Oh man, that fair is putting in work though. Oh my gosh. That was really smart. Uh, Death Horse went in there expecting air dodge, and instead of air dodging, he up beat early. Mm -hmm. And, uh,. Ended up taking him up. Maybe could have gone the spike hitbox, but it didn't seem like it. Now, I'm not sure if the Mewtwo Nair to um, double Disable? jump, yeah, the, the disable 
I'm not sure if that works. I'm not on sure. Kirby. Kirby might be a bit too fierce. Like, what? At this rate, if this is a quick deal, he's not going to get invincibility. That was a dodge. mistake that cost him the stop. Yeah. It's not wise to stick around on the stage like that. One of the things you definitely have to be careful of against Death Wars is uh, his first option, he'll always look for the fair because he, a lot of people uh, are air dodging off stage because they're just afraid of fair for good reason. But that's one of the things you, it just, it's one of those times where it becomes a 50 50 and you just air mobility really puts that pressure on you because he can pull you all the way down and just come back up. Exactly. You have to um, try to read his option when he goes off stage too. But it's still hard. Because you can never know. Oh my gosh, and he downbeats him out of the jab. I've not seen Death Force utilize that. Man, he's just to get a combo off of it too. Oh my gosh. Yeah, for the spike. And up these again, yeah. Maple's not air dodging anymore, so he's adapted to that, but it's a little late. Of course, I could always see Maple bring him back as long as he gets some. Um, as long as he pulls it to this is definitely dangerous for sure. A bear and then just a little bit more. And oh, nice one. And the up throw is... Kill. Yes, that's it. If Maple can get maybe some low percent combos or figure it all out, then I think he's good. And a late air, air dodge, dodge to save him. Very good. Knowing that uh, Death Wars was going to attempt to read the air dodge, he just waited it out. But the problem is, at this percent, Grab's also going to kill, so that really increases his options on how he can finish Oh my gosh. And he does an up throw. Up oh, there, Oh, and he, he he's reading his uh, grab attempts after mm. the uh, oh, that's gonna be oh. it. So the JV2. Yeah, JV2 from Death. Very good play from both of them. Yeah, I love watching people play all the time. It's just hard to deal with me sometimes. Yeah. And Death Wars being second ranked on our PR. Yeah. Yeah. Hard stuff for Maple, but good work from both players. He has fun commentating on his face. Space Stay signing real. off. <laughs> I don't know. Place, right? Yo, yo, everyone. Oh, yeah, he's got that. Cool. So, uh, if you're going to sit in this chair, you're player one. No, I'm sure player two. Okay. Mike? Yeah, oh, awesome. Thank you. So, how is everyone? How was the last match? It was pretty good. Maple uh, got too old, but he didn't play bad in my opinion. I mean, he's against Death Horse, so like, it's, a, it's a good. Crazy guy. Yeah. yeah. So it looks like we got Nugget and uh, Jonas, Sonic, Little Mac. Two the fastest well, the two fastest characters in the game. Are they? No I think so. Uh, Little Mac might be. No, I'm pretty sure Little Mac is second, and then because Captain Falcon is also very fast, so it's probably like I, I'm not sure. They, I'm not I think sure Falcon's either. third though. And they go to Flood Zone X to do a button shock, I think. Of course. Yo, I hate this stage. I know. There's the one part when the guy has the sausages and he's throwing the sausages. To the lady or whatever? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, what is that? Like, I'm sitting there for like 15 minutes trying to hide from this lady. I'm like, what the hell is this stage? You know, you, I and you grab them. No, you grab them at zero and they're dead. Like, really? at the ledge, yeah, because there's like, um, what, what's the word again? Uh, the blast zone. The blast zone. Uh, it's like, like, so close. So you can camp there the whole game. One time I lost. Okay, I'm going to tell you something embarrassing. I was trying to unlock the game and watch Super Mario. This is why I know how annoying this stage is. And it took me like two tries because he kept. Hey, what did he kept doing? I kept getting hit by Sausage Man, and then I was at the ledge, and he grabbed me and back to me. I never felt so bad about myself in my life. Wait, I've never felt so bad about myself. When the, like that challenge thing came up, yeah, like against like, Game and Watch, like, yeah. It's like a new challenger approaches. Or and something. you lost. I felt so bad. Wow. I was so mad at myself. Wow. Like I actually was so mad at myself. I, I never like. I'm ashamed to say it. I'm ashamed to say it. Like take me off uh, this PR dude. <laughs> True skill PR, right? True skill PR, I'm out. Yeah. I'm out. No, I don't have true skill. I really am <laughs> That is true skill. Right? Every every skill is all jank, dude. So, um, okay. So let's see where they go. Yeah. Sonic, uh, orange Sonic today, and blue, uh, little blue, Mac. Yeah. I played the loser this match. Yeah, yeah, good luck, wow. man. So, get ready to get freed up. I know. <laughs> I'm done for. Have you, uh, have you played any more sets? Yeah, I played two more. Okay, good. All right, so FD. You know, I think the one thing Little Mac can do is edge guard really well with that down B, but I don't know if it can work against Sonic. I'm pretty sure he can get right over that with that. Oh no, he's still trying it. Okay, I was wrong. Down, down smash. Down smash. Sorry, yeah. yeah sorry, I think I said down B. It is a little difficult to uh, ledge snap a Sonic, but it's not impossible. 
Good job, Jonas, canceling the dare there. It's pretty much like what Sonics have to do. If you screw that up, you're pretty much going to get a nice X smash from Wilma. Yeah, and he tries to down smash him, but Yonks goes right over. Yep, that was a good call on his part. Up tilt up. It's not true, but it's a mix of DI and reaction. Oh, and forward smash taking pretty early, I think. Yeah, and he still has the KO punch on deck. Like. Oh, and he's in KO kill. Yeah. Oh, he tried for the down tilt confirm. I think it's a confirm. Really I know. Oh. Oh, and it's gone. The homing attack meta. Apparently, um, the KO punch isn't actually based on on um the amount of damage dealt. It's based on knockback. I think so. But the, it doesn't really matter how much damage you do if you move, use a move that doesn't do knockback. Like for example, Fox Loser. Apparently, it won't cancel them. And a nice back air from you. Oh yeah, when you lose it. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. When you lose the KO punch. So I, I think you meant when you hit the KO punch. Yeah. So like if. if yeah, they, they have to get knocked back from Yeah, and I think he has like 10 seconds where he can't lose the KO punch when yeah. he gets it. Yeah. Oh, that is so dangerous trying to use that homing attack because he still has super armor, right, on all the smash attacks? Yes. That is... A really weird way to balance a game, too. It's like, let's give this guy horrible, uh, recovery. horrible recovery, but balance it out by making his uh, onstage game completely uh, stupid. The only thing on stage that's bad about him is I think his grab is really bad. His grab is horrible. Yeah, that's... Another thing, it's hard to land as him, right, because your aerials yeah. have no range, so you're forced to either, like, uh, commit to... Oh, my Great God. Great edge guarding there. Oh! I, I didn't even see Little Mac lose his first stock. I don't. Wow. I thought. How much did you sleep? I don't know. <laughs> you say I have to Anyways, I injected um, too many dude. What was I saying before? Yeah, Little Mac has trouble landing because he has to commit to a uh, down beat. His aerials aren't really useful or air dodging, right? To yeah. Get him back. And, like, it's not hard to wait for the counter and punish or air dodge. He's I, given so few options. I like what they did with this counter though, how it pushes you forward. Yeah. They, he really need, like he definitely needed that, but his counter is the fastest in the game. Too. Is it actually? I think so. I don't think his counter is very good though. This is uh, Nuggets one of his favorite stages to go to because of that uh, down smash. It, yeah. it works a lot better on the stage because people don't snap well. But he's already off stage. Jonas can get him. A nice high recovery mix up. Oh, and also, I think his up smash hits through the platforms on the stage. Dash attack into jab, the for glory little Mac combo. That inside the up stage. Yeah. So you just wait at the ledge. That's how you beat uh, little Mac online. Just wait there, and he's going to side B eventually. One time I JV3 a little Mac because I kept fighting him. <laughs> I felt bad about it, but I didn't feel bad about it. Was Dude, he was a little Mac. Like, he I kept waiting at the ledge, and when he got bitten, he lose your combo. So he kept getting bitten, and then, like, would die. He just did. <laughs> Do you know if the side B has super armor on it? The the haymaker punch I or whatever? Don't know. I hope so. I know, I just I don't know if you can edge guard him through it or not. I can count I know with the yes. counter character you can do that, but I'm not sure what Sonic can do. Oh my god, and he KO punches an oh Jesus. That's not gonna take the first off once again. Let's see if you can uh, hold it if jabs. Nice job, 14% there. He's so good with that uh, up B thing. Yeah. Well, it's hard to react to, right? Like, you're already probably moving in. And, and reach there. Great dodge and DI. Back. Great DI on him. I mean, great edge guard on Jonas' part. Ledge can't think when he had invincibility, so it was useless. And he just jumps like him. Yeah. Good job, Jonas noticing that he's not really approaching, oh, getting through. It is frame 3, it's really good, but it leaves him pretty vulnerable. Down smash works a lot better to get him on stage than up, uh, up, I mean not down, down, down throw. Because yeah. up throw just sends them up. I like, I call it the, uh, I read it on YouTube, some guy calls it the, uh, the chili dog kick because he like, looks like he's kicking you in the kitchen. Oh my god. <laughs> Was that on Reddit? No, I can't remember where that was. It was on YouTube. It was on YouTube. I can never remember really where it was on YouTube. There you go. Really quick fall. Fall down. Oh, dash attack twice. Let's go. <laughs> what was he doing there? Oh, he, he waited way too long on that. And that was a very... Ooh, that was really close to possible in the stock. Very scary. Wow. Oh, and he gets to the ledge. That was poor DI on that. Oh my gosh, dash attack into this. Got like... Oh my that god! That traded! That traded with the KO punch! Amazing! 
Yeah, he's at a really high percent, so Jab is just so easy to get out of him now. Yeah, he's, he should like realize that. Oh! oh that's gonna oh, kill? Oh, Are you God. serious? As soon as it hit, I was like, he's not gonna kill. Is oh it? my God. No. Oh, Yon's no. just got bodied. <laughs> oh. I was not expecting that to kill. Yeah, that, kind of that was literally on the he ground. He spins around in the air and then he kills you. Little Mac, chill out. That's not even a low ceiling stage, is it? No, I guess it tilted down and as it tilted. I don't know what happened. I, I can't remember. But all I saw was like Yon's getting body. Yeah. Nugget needs to chill out. Yon is probably going to go to uh, Duck Hunt. Let's see what happens. Oh no, he bans Duck Hunt from Little Mac because you can just treat camp. Oh yeah, because you can treat camp, yeah. I forgot about that. Well, I love it. It's this is, funny. This is yeah. also a good stage for Little Mac, to be honest, because that up B takes you right off the top, so... It depends who it is. If it's you, I would treat camping, you know? You treat... You literally timed someone out today. Yeah, you tried to time me out. I just walked in That's true. That's true. Alright, so uh, we got distracted. That was poor SDI on the Jonas' part there. He managed to get that. Oh! Once again, he gets the tilt. He's so, like, that's one of his bread and butter combos right there. Yeah. Well, another bread and butter combo from Little Mac is uh, forward smash. Into forward smash. Dash attack into dash attack, dash attack into jab. <laughs> he's just, there he's, it is, there it is. All his percent is just the jab. Oh my god, and he energizes into the red, just barely misses that down smash. First time I'm ever going to say that, or, or something like that. But, oh my god, a great air dodge. <laughs> great air dodge into the ground. <laughs> oh my god. He can just jab and it beats the spin dash, it looks like it. Well, so can Fox, I think. Oh, because of how quick it is. Uh, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, no, or, I mean, Little Max is frame one. It's like the best, one of the best jabs, frame wise. Well, I think the best jab is probably Charizard's, because I don't know what frame Charizard's is, but Charizard. it's a really good jab. He's got the KO punch. Oh my god, that was a forward tilt. tilt. Gonna take it. And so only 66 yes, percent. Yeah. Yeah, he's ready. Yeah. He's ready. Yeah. He about to go crazy. Oh my god. Yes. This is really. Later, like, he's yeah. approaching and he jabs him right out of the corner once again. And dash attack. Nugget is may have the lead, but he's still running. He does not care. Oh. oh. That was a uh, crazy. Yeah. Probably not, but like. Would have been close. Yeah. Damn. Still holding on to his stock too. He really goes for the forward smash read. He's just getting him with that jab. He's running up to him and he's just jabbing. It's not a bad option. I guess it's working. Ooh, and he tries to jab him out of the grab and he gets a. Uh, this is not looking good for Yoda right now. Oh. oh my God! Good DI. Good DI. Oh, that was almost a two stock, bro. Oh, and he gets with a huge deficit, but it's Little you can always make it better. You can gimp him, you can gimp him. Oh, dash attacks into jab once again, and that must be Staler. Wait, actually, he died. Oh, yeah, it's correct. Oh, okay, okay. Up beats for some reason, and Young's confetti is the punish. It's not like him. This is uncharacteristic. I think that if Nugget maybe tries to down smash. Oh, my God, F tilts again, and he's living. Great DI, great DI. No rage, so... Ooh, baby. Come on, boy. Come on. Dash, dash. Yeah, another up tilt. Yeah, oh my god, it took, he's at 19% on second start. Oh my god, Nugget. Wow. Just, wow. Just, wow. Just, wow. Just, wow. Just, wow. What a great play from Looks Nugget. like I get to play Jonas. And Nugget came at, in third at the Arcade I believe. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah third. Is, this is a good win for him because this is a great uh, win. is a uh, PR remember. player. Yeah, number seven. That was hype, dude. I was not expecting that to happen, but wow. I, like, that was hype, man. Like, to F tilt, both kills from F tilt, man. And that, that, uh, that, uh, what was it? Well, actually, like, that upbeat kill on my lot was so yeah, funny. I literally was not expecting that, that to kill. That was so sick. That was a great yeah. game. Little Mac and his partner in crime, his coach. I don't know. What if they brought, like, Mike Tyson instead of Little Mac? Like, I'm sure there's a skin for Mike Tyson. <laughs> Like but with like, the face tattoo no, but like, and everything. You know how it's Mike Tyson's punch out? Yeah. So like what if they're like, let's just bring in Mike Tyson? Like if Mike Tyson was still getting represented by Nintendo, do you think they'd bring him? Yeah. I'm sure they could. Imagine. I'm cheating Final Smash. I'm Except face. he needs he needs a moveset that involves pigeon and ghost. Exactly. Oh. Pigeon, pigeon ghost <laughs> and his uh, adopted daughter. <laughs> he has a projectile where he just throws a pigeon at you. Yeah. No man, boxers do not have projectiles. 
What the do you mean? The fist is mightier than the sword. I don't know if that the didn't fist have anything is, to do with it's the, the pen is mightier than the listen, sword, listen. silly. <laughs> so here we go. We got, uh, I think it's space oh, versus Pabu. I, I just space see space versus Pabu at the bottom. But who knows what Oh, yeah. <laughs> CDS space versus Bakery Pabu. And then Bakery Yonks on the side there. Yonks never leave the room. Yeah, he's, he's still sitting there. So what do you think of Sheik uh, Fox? Uh, we see a lot of her. I, I don't Not know here, at this yeah. point. Like, I don't really know what's going on with the Sheik meta after she got nerfed, but I know that like Fox has a lot of strengths and combos, and since Sheik falls so fast, he can probably just carry her uh, up to the top easily. But Sheik does obviously has the advantage of being very fast. Uh, could probably get the PP, like the perfect pivot combos. Uh, I think Fox has an advantage, but it's probably... like it's